Do you want to become a professional volleyball player? I play three world championships and I have for you 10 steps uh, which will help you to fulfill your volleyball dreams and become a professional volleyball player. Hi, I'm Jerry Popelka, Volley Country founder. You can find volleyball advice, tips and exercises on our YouTube channel. During class years I heard many times a question, how can I become a professional volleyball player? I can tell you it isn't easy, but at the same time it's possible if you follow these 10 steps. I played in many leagues and countries. During my volleyball career I have learned a huge amount what, about what it takes to become a professional volleyball player. So if you are thinking about becoming a professional volleyball player, these 10 steps are right for you. If you want to become a professional volleyball player for the money or fame, you need to have the sort of drive and passion where playing at the top level matters more to you than getting a paid uh, top money. To have the sort of grit and determination to get through all the stress, uh, downs and pressures of playing professionally, you need to have a true love uh, for the game or you will just end up being very unhappy. Recent studies have found that uh, the key to success in any field is practicing a specific task for a total of around 10,000 hours. Therefore, a player must train and play volleyball for at least uh, 10,000 hours before reaching world-class status. That's around 3 hours a day, 20 hours a week for 10 years. Don't forget that it isn't enough only to train, you need to concentrate in your trainings and work at 100%. You need to touch many many balls before your volleyball skills will be at the top level. You need also to work on all 8 elements of a volleyball player. Training smart is an equally important if not more important than training hard. In team trainings uh, you follow what the coach wants the team to do, but not what you need to train as an individual player. Each player has uh, their own unique set of skills, uh, which is why it's extremely important to train on your own or with small groups, uh, so you can improve your specific weaknesses and make your strengths second nature. Coaches are saying you are not good enough, uh, you are making mistakes and players are sometimes uh, yelling and screaming at you. This is an everyday occurrence in volleyball and you must have a deep belief uh, to get you through all the negativity you will encounter. That belief has to come from somewhere. I believe in the formula that belief uh, plus hard work and smart work plus uh, persistence equals success. To become a professional volleyball player, you need the sort of belief where you believe uh, you can move mountains. A promo video of uh, yourself these days in the modern age of high-speed internet, YouTube and Instagram is essential to getting as much interest as possible. If you have a good video or more videos that make it easy for people to assess uh, your skills, it's easier to get opportunities with teams. Get family or friends to film you training and playing and make sure the video quality is excellent. Just like applying for a job, a volleyball CV should be able to explain a coach or club or agent all about who you are as a player in less than a minute. Include a player photo, height, weight, uh, position, experience, link to articles you've been featured in and statistics. Now that you have the skills and the tools, you have to find ways to show off uh, your talent. And here are a few ways to find opportunities. If you are under 18, look out for trials in local youth clubs, uh, schools and academies. Email and contact through Facebook and Instagram as many clubs as you can, but don't expect to replies. You may need to email 50 or more clubs before receiving a reply. Consider getting a volleyball agent. Uh, however, many agents uh, can be very deceiving, so be careful. Some players have famously been accepted into teams just by showing up uh, to a practice session with their boots and asking if they could train with them. It's easy to only think of getting to the next level instead of focusing on your performances in matches. Take your volleyball career game by game. Every game you play, focus on playing well and giving 110% as you never know who could be watching. Make sure you build a good relationship with your teammates, coaches and club staff as having their off-field support will contribute to good on-field performances. 
I knew it was going to be difficult, but trying and becoming a professional volleyball player was very tough. It took me a lot of effort, time, sacrifice, sometimes luck and motivation. That's because becoming a professional volleyball player doesn't happen overnight. It doesn't take months either. It takes years and lifetime of dedication. When you hear people say that success takes blood, sweat, tears, they are totally right. It takes time and patience. Sometimes you have to wait for the right opportunity. Sometimes it takes just a bit of luck to swing your directions. But being persistent and having the ability to never give up will determine whether you are successful or not. The final step in realizing your professional dreams is signing a pro contract with a club. Contracts should be carefully looked over in details first. And if it's your first contract, get it uh, looked over by someone with experience in this area. Be careful when dealing with agents and take careful note of training compensation and player ownership issues. I believe these 10 steps and advices will help you in realizing your volleyball dreams. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.